Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to teach you how to clip engines without getting heat damage in SFS. Because a while ago there was an update in which they made sure that if you clip engines and then fire them, there will be heat going up very quickly and the engines will explode because of the heat damage. Now there is a way to make sure you don't get this heat damage, like you can see here. And now I'm going to show you how you can do this yourself. So I'm going to go to the build area and I'm going to get a clean building area then I'm going to get one new engine. You can also do this with your already existing blueprints but for now I'm going to show it using an engine like this. I'm going to save this blueprint, I'm just going to name it one. Now I'm going to go to my home screen and you will see this file manager and you want to install a file manager for this because not all of the default file managers on all phones work. So I've personally installed this one but there are others that also work. You're going to click it, then go to main storage, then click on Android, then click on data and you're going to look up Steph. Now this will give you the file from Spaceflight Simulator. So you're going to click this, you're going to click on files, saving, then on blueprints and then you're going to click on the blueprint with the engine or engines that you want to remove the heat damage from. And then you're going to click on blueprint and then you will see this blueprint with the information of each part in the blueprint and their exact position and more things like that. And now we're going to actually do something called BP editing or blueprint editing. And a lot of people think this is very complicated, but it's not that complicated as it is sometimes made you to believe because I'm doing it right now and you can too. So now we can see that there is just one engine in this blueprint. And at the bottom here, you can see heat on for creative use, true. Now instead of this true, we're going to put false. And this will shut off the heat damage. And now we're going to save the blueprint, go back to Spaceflight Simulator, then load up the blueprint of which we remove the heat damage. And now we can copy this engine and we can clip these two inside of each other like you would normally. Then I'm going to just make it into a quick rocket and that's also the wrong thing. No, where is it? Six wide. Now I'm going to put a fuel tank on top like so and of course a controller part. It can either be one of these, a probe or a capsule. And now if I launch it, I can switch on the engines and I can fire them up like so. Hang on, my touch screen is Okay, there it goes. And there the rocket goes. It lifts off with the two clipped engines and it doesn't get heat damage. And I myself find this very useful because you can now build way bigger rockets and you all will be able to do this as well. So I hope all of you find this useful as I do. And if you did, then please leave a like on this video and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more content like this. And then I hope to see you all in the next video. So thanks for watching and bye bye.